All right, so here's the latest episode of Oliver, Daddy, and Dumb Dog. Go on a walk. Uh, where we left off, I think we talked about the twins and their battle. Like, they're rolling the battle, they're flying the drones around. Uh, which character, which chapter are you going to do next? Are you going to do, like, Mom and Aunt Kate? Like, who's together in this? So, um... Because they're all kind of in different spots on the battlefield. Let me see. Mom and Aunt Kate are, um... Ooh, I wonder if um, Aunt Kate's husband, I bet he's, like, flying some sort of, like... Like, bomber planes? Well, it's such a small area. I don't know if he could fly a bomber plane, but maybe he's flying a helicopter. Because I feel like a helicopter is really the only thing that could fly around Central Park safely. Oh my gosh, well, it is so hot right now. They did that... Okay, so, um... Then... But I don't know he, if you need an entire d- chapter he has just telling about. a bomb... Like a oh, couple okay. of bombs, so if there's just like um evil robots waiting to go into battle because okay. they're like at the, like the very back, mm-hmm. he can like drop a bomb. Okay. And then nobody except the evil people get hurt. Oh okay. What if they're like? Have you ever heard of a nanobot? That like um. That wasn't thunder. Corrupt. Right? That like that yeah, like. That wasn't thunder. Corrupt. We're gonna go the reverse direction, Oliver. That cor- that, yeah, so that corrupts. Yeah, in a lot of sci-fi movies, they've got. Um, She's not shaking. They've got little um, nanobots, which are like super, super tiny. So maybe um, they're programmed to um, like destroy whatever it lands on. No, because then maybe it lands on a good robot. Well, they're programmed to destroy the enemy robots. How do they know which enemy robots are which? Ooh, that's a good question. Maybe. Oh, what if he shoots? Oh, like like a dart, like a dart gun with nanobot darts. Yeah. What if it's like a special paint that he shoots onto the enemy robots, and then they spray like from the helicopter? No. What if what if he has a giant, you know those giant paint paint bombs? Yeah. In this might get him a little messy, but giant paint bombs and a gun. But he doesn't want to accidentally get paint on the good guys. No, when, right before it's going to hit, he shoots it. Yeah. Hit it, the bad guys. But, he shoots but it. But how does he make sure it only gets on the bad guys? Are you saying like... He goes at the very before back. The ba- oh, okay. He goes so he's at working the very from the back, back, and the other robots are working from the front. Yes, the other good robots are oh, working okay. from the front. So he drops his paint. No, yeah. This paint spray canister that explodes and sprays this paint that lets the nano robot, and then he drops. And let's and it's a certain kind of color that um tells the nano robots that it's it it's um what. It's the a bad guy. Okay. And so that's what he's doing. So is that so maybe this chat like there's a short chapter about him dropping those from the rear. And then maybe in the same chapter or like the next chapter you could write about Look at Raisin's little butt shaking. <laughs> and on the ground. Maybe you could write about Aunt Kate and uh Janet. Okay, let's do, let's just do Aunt Kate. Okay. So what's Aunt Kate doing? Aunt Kate's doing... Yeah, it would make sense. So maybe uh, Aunt Kate's, the first part of the chapter and the second part of the chapter is her husband. Okay. So that they they can kind of be combined into one chapter. Okay. So what's Aunt Kate's role in the battle? Aunt Kate's role in the battle is to, if they're hurt too much, to, to click a button because Zach and Cody are doing the little robots Uh I mean the little drones that if they're wounded they can tell um, Aunt Kate which ones so she's orchestrating the like rescue robots yes no 
Um, the robots are programmed because they have a button inside that if Aunt Kate presses a remote button, it will tell that specific robot to go back and for repairs. And, oh, okay. And Jane and her mom are the repair people. Gotcha. And maybe they've also got um, some robots that can go and pick up injured robots. Like if they're too injured to walk away. Mm -hmm. Like they can send out, they've got some stuff, Ambu robots, like like ambulance, like... Ambu bots, you mean? Yeah, or Ambu drones. And they just run in and do repairs on the fly. Yeah, no, they're like huge, like, um, they're like huge, like, um, there's two people controlling it, and it's, um, Jane and her mom basically okay and um they um they fly to where a uh, robot is to her and he they have like a um like a like a you know those indent indentions like like a wedge that he uh -huh. like look like this uh -huh. so it picks up the robots mm -hmm. And put and puts them into the thing. Okay. Like then the they they take probably another robot because it take so long. Um. And the ten people that I were tell that I was telling you about uh -huh. is a couple of the elite team. You know the elite team. Uh huh. Cause all people have it like. The government has an elite team okay. that can, so yeah, so, um, yeah, so sorry the, government for expo exposing you. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so the elite team is the one who goes and does the rescues. Now, what's going to happen in the battle, so at some point there needs to be like, uh, like a lot of times in these movies, there's like, or these stories, there's like a, a moment when it looks like everything's going well. And then something has to go like terribly wrong. And it looks like they're gonna lose. Like, uh, someone should, could get captured or like. Daddy! Oh, sorry, you're I going jumped too, too far, ahead. far ahead. Okay. So I already have that planned out. Oh, sorry, 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 sorry. Spoiler alert. Yeah, Daddy. Why did you spoil it? Jeez. Okay. Now they know Margo. a week ahead. I don't know, Marco. Okay, Todd. <laughs> um, so, yeah, and um, what were we talking about again? Uh, okay, so. The elite team. The elite team, yeah. And the elite team aren't yeah. robots. They're people. better than robots. They're people that, um, that are protecting. There's three robots protecting the repair bay. Okay. And, um, I mean, three people are protecting the repair bay, three elites. Okay. And. Are they like super soldiers? Yes, kind of. Do they have like, like a robot suit, kind of like Iron Man, just like, or no? You literally said what I was just about really? to say. Really? Yes, they mind. have an elite team. Of things not as quite strong as Iron Man, because like you'd have to make ten of those suits. Yeah. Um. It's. Um. Is it more like in Avatar? You know how they've got the Walker suits that like they can control, but they're not as. No. No, not like that. Mm -mm. So it's kind of like. You know the very first iron suit? Yeah. The one he makes in the desert? It's kind of like that, but uh, smaller. Gotcha. Okay. So, yeah. It's basically the exact same as um, the, like, the regular I Iron Man, like his general suit right now. Uh -huh. But the stuff inside it doesn't look like it. The stuff inside it is like from it is like a, re a replica of the iron man stuff okay. that's cool 
So they're the ones who are this elite force that are protecting. Yeah. All right, so are you jumping to a new person? No. no. Actually, no. Well, kind of. We're jumping. We're not. We have. We actually we're already talking about the new person, the chief and the chief of police. Oh, I forgot about her. Does it's she have the her own only chapter? time she's gonna gonna have half a chapter. Okay. She's gonna have half a chapter about the elite team and her. So she's leading the elite team. And all the robots. Okay. So yeah. And then and is she gonna do like one of those like really uh, impressive speeches where she's like, do it for your families. Do it for, do it for, do it for your kids. Do it for your dogs. This is for, this is for my great, 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 great grandfather there. Start of the dog. Nope. Well, technically, it was her, um, it was, um, do it for Johnny. Sorry, you won't get that reference until you're in seventh grade. So, um, yeah, and um, so the elite team, it's basically just t t t talking all about the elite team. Mm -hmm. And there's like a quarter of a page where it's, actually no, it's like a page where um, the uh, elite team is like going out and doing something. So basically the whole chapter is about, the, is like learning what like, like the schematics about the elite team. You know, you guys don't have to, just, just if you, if you just want to, um, if you just want to skip that part, I'm probably just gonna like put, um, I, I'm probably, I'm just gonna put like. So are you talking about like schematics of like. Like what the elite the, team. What the suits look like and stuff? Yes. Maybe you have that at the end of the book. Like uh, in the, there's like an index section at the end where it's got all the pictures and stuff. And, and um, at the end is gonna be like all the hard words. Oh, like a, yeah, like a glossary? Yeah, cause this is not, this is um, a grade, um, like two grades above, it's like fourth grade level. So this seems like a, a book that like kids who maybe aren't interested in reading, all of a sudden it's gonna hook them in. Yeah, like, like me, like yeah. me in the I Survive series. Yes, yeah, where they're like, uh, I don't wanna read, but then they're like, oh wait, this book has robots? This book has uh, well, 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 battles, well, it, space it, travel, time travel. If um, it, to be honest, diagrams. Um, be, to, to be honest, what? my um, my book is kind of like a replica of iRobot, so they should probably just watch iRobot instead. It's not a replica. It's you use iRobot for inspiration. But well, there are enough differences. Yeah, but still. The only the only real similarities are the design of the robot, I think. And the and battle. Having, having and the battle. Kind of. Kind of. But there's, a, there's a lot of movies with battles like that. Robot battles. Okay, so um So okay, so you you have this partial chapter with um the uh what's it called? The police commissioner or the head of the police chief of police chief of police there we go That's you don't even know your own you, you don't even know i know the your the um, jobs better than you yeah pretty much you know you don't have to talk right into the microphone um so yeah and um <laughs> so the elite team is do you think you'd be on the elite? They team? would be no, not even close. What about me? No. What? You're saying Raisin elite? would be elite dog. Elite dog, yes. Dumb dog. All right, so you've got this chapter about the. Cause look, she'd yep. be in a, a great elite dog. 
Cause, cause she oh, well, keeps, dogs need to follow no, directions. keep she she keeps sniffing. She's not follow, She doesn't follow directions. She has to follow directions. She leads. Okay, so so after that chapter, what's gonna happen? No, Dad, you're skipping too far ahead. Well, I'm sorry. So um um. Um, no, no, probably not. Um, so, well, what, what, which character do you want to focus on next? Hi. Next, wait, nope, we're, nope, 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 we're, can't say hi. Nope, we're nope. still talking, we're still talking about the, this. The police chief? No, the poli elite team. Oh, so, okay, so there's 10 people on the elite team. And three are at the, three are protecting, um, med bay. Okay. Where are the other seven? And this, um... Are actually, any of them in the helicopter? Actually, there's six. Um, there's six. There's one in the helicopter driving the helicopter, obviously. Why, why wouldn't the... Because he's the one shooting stuff out. Why wouldn't he be flying and the elite soldier be shooting it? Um... Because, you know, elite soldiers know strategy and strength. But and how to fire guns. A, a commercial pilot probably doesn't know how to fire the gun very well. Okay, fine. <laughs> you, the, don't, you don't have to. I'm just the, the the co-pilot the co-pilot is um the 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 um what what you might call it um he's the what you might call it um. I don't remember his name. <laughs> Kate's husband. Roger. 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 Um, stop. Um. So. Um. Yeah. Can one of the Robert or Ro Roberts, one of the robots say Roger, Roger? Daddy. That's in. Uh, you know me so well. Do I? Yes. It's in Star Wars. I was literally part? gonna have 100 of them programmed not to say anything except Roger, Roger. <laughs> and Roger's like, what? Why are they talking about me? Roger, Roger. <laughs> Where's Roger, Roger? <laughs> okay, so, um. Must follow Roger, Roger. Um, whoa, Raisin. Raisin was doing a little two-legged dance. She was like this. <laughs> yeah, they can't see what you just did. <laughs> I, was talk I was talking to you. Oh, I, I thought you were talking to the podcast world. No, sorry, podcast. You can't see my elite jumps. <laughs> no, there's a reason why Oliver's not on the Elite Force. <laughs> you demonstrated it just now. Roger, Roger. <laughs> okay, so we need to wrap. Raisin, raisin. Okay, stop. <laughs> we need to hey, actually keep going. Okay, we're, hey, we're almost home. So, um, the, um, the, there's actually six Elite members. And actually, the best Elite member of them all... That's actually how she came to, um, um, chief of police. Oh, so she's she's like... Two times better than the elite members. So she's, she's a former elite team member and now team lead because she was so good. Yes. Gotcha. She, and she was so trusted. So is she on the battlefield? Yes. Okay. The, 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 um, the, there's, there's this like base Kind uh -huh. of, where they built like walls, okay. and um, and um, they um, the seven and the chief of police. That's kind of like their last defense. Okay. So if everything fails, um, all they have is that Does like, she have a cool like twenty five humans against like one thousand. People. Does she have a cool uh, weapon? Like, does she have a blaster? Does she have a? She has all. She has a blaster. She has a. <laughs> no. Like she has a. Machine gun. <laughs> what are these futuristic weapons? Lasers. <laughs> a dub. It's called a double gun. It's a double gun. Um. Um. 
It's very, very heavy. It's better than, it's, no, it's, it's super, super light. It's twice as good as machine gun. It has two of them strapped together. And there's a rocket launcher on the wow. side. All right, that's it for this episode. So, and uh, all the other ones have um, one machine gun, one machine, like, um, okay. All right, that's it for this episode. Uh, like one machine, Daddy. SMG, okay, um, and uh, Dumb Dog and Oliver. Bye. Bye. Peace.